Do you want to start with best bargains, worst values? We know the top players. Um, where do you want to start? Uh, let's start with bargains. Okay. Bargains, yeah. Uh, so I got I got Trevor Ariza, Patrick Beverly, Dwayne Wet, Deadman, Austin Rivers, and Ricky Rubio. Now, I feel like some of these guys can go either way where, where it's either you get them for a huge bargain or like someone like Malcolm Brogdon where it's going to be like someone's either going to way overpay him or they get him for – and he turns out to be a great bargain. So some of these guys can obviously go either way. But, Ben, how how expensive is Malcolm Brogdon going to be? Let's say the Lakers are interested in Malcolm Brogdon. What will it cost to get a restricted free agent? I mean, you're hearing numbers over $20 million, which seems like I would have – I mean, at that number, I'd probably put him in an overpay camp. But Man, I, I don't I mean, see that, though. What, what is Alan Crabb making? I think he was at around 17, right? I would take Malcolm Brogdon at 20 if Alan Crabb is getting – if Harrison Barnes is just turning down whatever, $25 million, I I would love to have Malcolm Brogdon if I'm the Lakers. I, I think yeah. he – oh, my gosh, yes. He's a great yeah, no, defender. I, I, I agree with that. Yeah, great For defender. Sure. He can shoot. He's a great free throw shooter. There's no drama. He's uh, 25 – I think he's not young, young, but he's, you know, he's mature to go in there. And I would absolutely, if I was loading up and I'm the Lakers, I would go Brogdon, Beverly and Bogdanovich. I would go after those three and I would, I would take on the rest of the world. Yeah. You think you can get those many guys for, for what is it? 32 million? Probably not, but that would, (laughs) that would be my goal. I mean, yeah, that would be a nice package for them. But Brogdon would be great because he can play, on the ball, off the ball, he can guard sort of multiple positions. He's he's pretty pretty big for for point guards. Is there a big name that's a bad value? I mean, you you mentioned Barnes, so I don't know. Like, I don't know if that's a big name or whatever, but I I would say someone like Tobias Harris or Vucevic. Those guys, they're, I mean, given about how many max slots there are out there how many teams are looking for guys. You kind of expect that those guys are going to get somewhere near that. For more Dan Patrick Show, tune in to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV, stream for free on BR Live, or download the Dan Patrick Show app.